Hey, what's up, Internet? It is Vita, day 31, the last day. Technically, I think I still have nine minutes before this day is over to uh, record this video and get it uploaded and technically have uh, not missed the day. So today, for the final Vita video, is the wrap-up thoughts. What was the experience like? And, you know, that I tell you what else I'm going to talk about, but then why would you watch the rest of the video? See? Uh, it's kind of funny that the last video is a straight one-taker right from the phone, but I uh, helped my sister-in-law move tonight and just got home a little bit after 11 o'clock, so I don't really have any time to record something on the computer and edit it all fancy-pantsy with fireworks. So no fireworks for the final video. So, looking back, I, this was pretty cool. It was hard. And I didn't, didn't do it. I didn't make it. I missed about seven days, so I, I did a little bit more than 75% of the days. Um, I understand that there's some type of punishment video concept coming for the days that were missed, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, I'm disappointed that I didn't do it. Um, it would have been nice to been able to declare victory and completion, but I am glad that I'm sitting here on day 31 doing a video that I didn't hit that that bump in the road in the middle of the month when I when I stopped and just stopped like for reals, but that I I, I picked it up and and ran with it. So I feel good about that. I'm I'm pretty bad with these types of challenges. Um, Tim, uh, uh, we did a. Um, not last year, not, I think it was 2010, <clears throat> there was a 28-day challenge <coughs> uh, to blog every day in February. And I was pretty hot with it for a while, and then it just fell off. And so it's, I'm, I'm glad that it's the end of the month and I'm, I'm still doing this. So, so it gave me awesome. Um, what have I learned from the experience? Well, one is, I'm editing, especially from editing the blooper reel yesterday and having to go back and look at the old videos, uh, I definitely feel a lot more comfortable doing video blogs now than I did at the beginning of the month. Um, I think I'm more natural in how I do them now. and Just as dorky, but I'm comfortable in the dorky, you know? Um, saying you know a lot in this video. I don't usually do that. and Usually I get to edit them. Maybe that's why you don't see them. I also do this a lot. I learned from the blooper reel when I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Um, the other thing that's super cool is I met a bunch of really awesome people through doing Vita. Uh, quite a few of them I kind of knew from the Twitters a little bit in passing, and I feel like I got to know them really well from Vita. Some of them I got to meet in person. I, I, I don't think I would have gone and met a lot of you folks who were here for the 20 SP Summit a couple of weeks ago if I hadn't been doing Vita. That really kind of drove that uh, to, to actually meet up with folks and, and see them. And, you know, it definitely adds some connection. And uh, I don't remember, I think it was in the Passion video uh, when Right to Reach, and Ashley was, was talking about being passionate. It must have been because it was being about being passionate, but about connections and connecting to people. And I think that's real important. And I think it's something I don't do as much as I should. And I feel like that's a really great thing that's come out of this. Um, I'm really glad I did it because it's a, it's a part of me The video production kind of thing and not that I've been doing any real high-end production with this stuff but just playing with video playing with editing something that was real big for me not not vlogging but just video in general for for part of my life I'm, and it's been dormant for a long time <clears throat> it was pretty cool to do it and I, I'm I'm just really pleased with this experience and uh, I'll do it again and I think I'll be doing more vlogging with my blog going forward. Do it every day? No. No. Maybe we'll try once a week. One, once a week, a Matt vlog. Might be cool. Might be cool. But for the last time in August of 2011, I love your faces. Thanks, Vita. This was cool.